Hey YouTube, here's today's project. I have the brake control module out of my 2004 Volvo uh, XC70. And I love the car, but it's been throwing uh, ABS lights and the traction control has been kicking on and the ABS pump is running under the brake and it's just kind of uh, not doing great things. So <clears throat> the very common diagnosis is uh, bad solder connections here. And there's a lot of videos out there on that. But I haven't really found a good one on how to open these up. So this is, uh, like I say, a, a Volvo unit, and there appears to be uh, some type of a adhesive or sealer all the way around here. So my idea is that we'll take a uh, an end mill. Um, so I bought these, uh, a set of these on uh, Amazon for for like 15 bucks or something pretty reasonable. And uh, it's an end mill, so we'll cut square uh, on the back on like a drill bit, which is not really designed to cut sideways. So. Um, my idea is, is check this up in my uh, drill press here and we'll see what happens. So I'll put this up on a block because this uh, particular module has the uh, extended connector for uh, I believe that goes to uh, the ABS pump motor. Um, so I can't really lay it down flat on the drill press. I'll put it up here on this block. Something like that. In, uh, okay, it turns out I do not have a depth gauge on this uh, drill press, so I'll just have to use one hand and control the depth and the other hand to move it around and uh, we'll see what happens. So you can see it uh, makes a nice little slot in there. So I think we'll just continue that all the way around, uh, figure out how deep that needs to go and uh, take it from there. So I found that cutting deep is a little bit harder to going sideways, so I set the table up. Um, so just cutting a little bit, I'll make a few passes around here. Okay, here it is. It's all done. It turned out not as good as I had hoped, but uh, it's not too bad. Um, I pried this off. And you can see I still have the lip around here, which is nice. It'll help uh, get the glue back in. And here's the inside of the, uh, the ABS module that I go to work and re-solder all these. Or solder, there's no solder on them, which is a problem. So I'll solder these, at, solder these up and uh, get that glued back on. Some type of RTV silicone, something like that. And uh, should be good to go. But that's uh, uh, a pretty good way to go. If you had like an actual mill, it'd be a lot better. Um, and obviously there's some a learning curve to doing it on a drill press, but definitely doable. The, uh, the end mill uh, was definitely better than uh, some of the other methods that I tried. So give her a shot. Let me know in the comments. Thanks. Like. Subscribe.